joined by Jalen Keaton of the Summers County Bobcats. Jalen, first of all, I appreciate the time. What did you do during the coronavirus to keep you in shape for this season? Uh, just lifted whenever I could, did whatever I possibly could to make myself better and try to help out the team. What? The, how much did you get done? Did you get stronger? I know you missed last season. I'll ask you about that in a second. But did you really want to get uh, get things going? Because yeah, because missed I missed the uh, well. When coronavirus come out, I was uh, sad because I missed the whole junior year because of an injury, and I didn't want to potentially miss a senior year because of the coronavirus. What? The, what happened in, on your injury? What I know it was in. I think. The, First half of the first game against Pikeview? Yeah, against Pikeview, I went after the quarterback about two plays before halftime, and it just gave out, popped, and I was done after that. Not even hit? You didn't even... No, I didn't even get hit. Did you know as soon as it happened? I knew something happened, yeah, because it hurt pretty bad. And, and to, to miss a season, your coach said you're still a bit of a leader for the team. Yeah. What did I, you do? Uh, did you kind of take on a role to coach a little bit? Yeah, I tried to just help out all the younger people, get them coached up and as best as I could and be there for him so I wasn't just completely wasting it away you know are were you are you a senior this year yeah I'll be a senior you're a senior so you were on the uh, team that went to the semifinals yes do you see a lot of this team and what you guys were able to do then yeah because uh well this freshman class is well the senior class was the freshman class that year so we learned from a good team and then the team after that taught us well also we just had a bad year last year and we're going to bounce back this year you're able to open up this year because of the coronavirus. They pushed the season back, so you missed the Pikeview game. But you're going to open up against Greenbrier West, which is a, kind of a traditional rival for you guys. Yes, How do you feel about that? Now, you know, just opening up with that team. Uh, well, I don't think it's a bad thing. I like to come out, see what we got, see what they got early out in the season. Just look forward to a great first game, a good fight early. And your uh, offensive lineman, uh, what do, what's your strength on the line? What do you think your top skill is as an offensive and or defensive lineman? Well, uh, on uh, offense, I'd like to say pulling probably. But uh, off a of, off of knee injury, I'm not really sure if that'll still be it. But uh, just a fundamental blocker. And uh, defense, I'm, I'm pretty good at getting off the block. Have you... Do you feel the effects of the knee injury at all? Uh, it's every once in a while, you know it's the, you know it happened. Right. Um, Isaiah Brown was a very important part of your this program, and his brother obviously is a player on the team. How how tough was the off season after that tragedy? It was it was pretty hard knowing it because we grew up all of us on the team. We all sat in those stands and watched Isaiah, and you knew when Isaiah got the ball, it was gonna be something crazy. So. Uh, it definitely hurt, but it gave us a new motto for the season. We're going with a uh, play for Zay as a little secondary motto. Play for him, biggest fans, always going to be there watching us now. Okay. And Jane, I appreciate your time. Yeah. Good luck this year. Thank you.